And now, the Freedom First Sports Desk with John Apicello. 18 miles separate Appomattox County High and Ruskburg High. They're basically neighbors. So when the two get together, it's another backyard brawl, if you will. Our Brooke Leonard is at our game of the week. The battle for the lantern is a rivalry game. And Brooke, these border bashes tend to get emotional. What about this one? Yeah, they sure have, and Appomattox Emotion has been pretty happy for the last seven years. They've won this matchup, but Burt Torrance is in charge at Rustburg, has been for the last two years, and I think that things are trending in the right direction for the Red Devils. He's pretty much brought everything. He's bringing a whole lot of energy. He's definitely improved this team a whole lot. Burt Torrance has a history of winning. His last job was defensive coordinator at Heritage, making his knowledge of how to stop teams in one of the toughest districts in the state an asset for an easy hire. I know Rustburg is there. They, they fly to the ball. I know their coach. Their coach is very hard work and very determined. So um, I'm expecting a very good game from them, of course. The Red Devils enter tonight's game 1-0 and and are set to take on a relentless Appomattox team who knows how to wear a team down with explosion and athleticism. Um, we've talked about all their defensive fronts and their offense, um, running all those veers and dives and stuff. I mean, we're pretty much, we're all scouted up on them. But Rustburg may be the biggest dark horse in the Seminole District, and Appomattox head coach Doug Smith knows one thing for sure. A hard-nosed football team that knows what they're doing. Uh, no doubt, uh, they play quality football. Coaches coach these guys up to do the right things, and and uh, so you know, you're not going to see things that are unsound. You're going to see sound stuff that that is is tough to beat for sure. You know, you're not going to walk in there and just think you're going to go against a team that don't know what they're doing. Happy, of course, this is the Battle of the Lantern. This is what is at stake in addition to starting the season out 2-0. This game kicks off in just over 30 minutes. Live in Rustburg for the Game of the Week, I'm Brooke Leonard. Back to you.